The application itself is very simple. All it is is a bunch of cards organized by categories, and the cards take a variety of formats. This is the basic interface that you see here, a card. This is a multi-true-false question card. You can put in selections, and then you click show answer, and that moves on to the next card. Down here, you can filter down by specific areas that you're interested in. If I want to see just New York practice, I click here, automatically filters. When I'm ready to go through the deck, I can go here and type intermediate answers. I can answer the question, see the answer, continue to the next card. Proceed through the entire deck. At any given time, I can rank these cards based on how important they are to my study plan, how good the quality of the card is, this is important when other people add cards, and how difficult it is. Later on, I'll put filtering functionality on those. If you want to add cards to the system, come to the second tab, this is the Add Card tab. First step is to pick a category where the card will go, or add a category by clicking on the parent category and adding here. If I want to add a new category to this Barbary card, it's called Multi-State Cards. Pretty straightforward. And then I can proceed to add test questions. I can do straightforward question answer save or I can do multiple true falses this would be the question or the stimulus up to five statements five explanations and this is whether each is true or false so I can say test A A is true B is true and you get the point if A is actually true I check this put an explanation if B is really false I wouldn't check this I put an explanation Similarly, you can use true-false questions. There will be more features coming soon based on what people need. The goal is to get people to collaboratively add many different cards across all the barber categories of the system, such that whenever you want to study, you just pull up the relevant category and blast through it.